So it's nearly 80 years now to the day since the Dambusters did their thing and that thing was put a massive spanner in the works of the Nazi war effort. It was no mean feat. They had just two months to train for this special mission and they were heroes one and all, including their dog, sod it. Their dog was a hero and all. But I'm not allowed to say his name, which rhymes with Trigger, which incidentally was the name they changed it to back in the 90s. So RAF's 617 Squadron were specially assembled in March 1943 to bomb three dams in Germany's industrial heartland, and they succeeded. They used the famous bouncing bombs, of course, and these were explosives that literally skipped and bounced on water until they hit their intended target. Now, the hysterical woke lefty mob, they seem intent on getting rid of the Dambusters and erasing it from British history because they're on about demolishing their RAF base and replace it with housing for illegal migrants. Have you ever heard of such blasphemy? And of course, there was the video I did a few days ago regarding their mascot dog. They want to dig up his grave in case it offends one of them. Can you believe that? So, not intent with trying to make the nation forget about the famous 617 Squadron, the Dambusters, and erasing them from history, the woke BBC went one better. And when she was describing the Dambusters' anniversary and what they did, BBC journalist stroke activist Sally Nugent used the word infamous to describe the Dambusters' raid. Now, to me, infamous means bad, a terrorist act, something that's not nice, not popular, something that's detrimental. I mean, they did all that to the Nazis, and the Nazis were the bad guys, right? And don't the lefty woke mob, don't they hate Nazis? So why all the hate towards the Dambusters for fighting real Nazis back in the day in World War Two? You see, the BBC as a state broadcaster, it has a very unpatriotic soul. They're like some of the uh, socialist scousers in Liverpool land. Very anti-British, very unpatriotic. And yet another reason not to pay your TV licence. Because you're paying the BBC to hate you, basically. If you're a patriotic Brit, if you voted for Brexit, if you love this island, group of nations within it, if you love the people, culture, history then the BBC isn't for you and the BBC hates you and the BBC wants you to pay it through the TV licence fee uh, so we can hate you. And remember, the BBC is chock full of people like Gary Lineker as well. So there we go. Screw Lineker, screw the BBC, screw Sally Nugent and up the Dambusters. And there we go. That's my video. Hope you like. Let me know what you think in the comments. And until the next time, Roger Trout.